Hello, Sim friends, and it is that time again. We have a new round of architect homes, and these homes are repeats with the exception of one, I think. So let's get started and see what this round has in store for us. So here is the first home. This is a repeat home. We've had this not too long ago, and so in terms of inventory, we have those purple stools and, of course, the villa couches. It's the exact same as the last home that we had. I think this was in the last round. I can't remember. Sims has lost its um, originality when it comes to architect homes. It's, um, it's just completely gone. And that's quite sad because the architect homes used to be way better than this crap. But not anymore. So, so yes, you do get those purple stools and you do get the outside grill. And, and of course, the villa couches. And then you get some spa items. And you do get some toddler items. Like those daycare items. And that's about it, y'all. That's not much with this house at all. And here is this house. Um, you have those school, like, compost bins in the front. And you have that outdoor lounge chair. And then on the side, you have a sandbox. So, I don't think that sandbox is available in the game anymore. Uh, but I'm not sure. So when you enter in, I can already tell you I'm not a fan of the layout at all. Um, you have a quite a small kitchen here. And then you have some uh, uh, the family furnishing items. And those urban sofas. Then you go up the stairs. I mean, you have a crib right there. We've had this house before. And there's not much... There's not really anything in here that's original. It's, um, you know, it's all stuff that we've had before. I really don't like the layout of the house. Um, and the appearance of it is okay. And here is this house. I do like the appearance of this one. It looks very nice and organized. Um, and and um, and then you do get uh, these white windows, which is quite nice. And you do get those pool items. So you know. So take care. Uh, so take note of that. That was in the Palm Perfection update. You get these uh, countertops and the geo stools. And there's no doorways in here. How nice, Sims. You take shit out. And you do get the couch and also the captivating coast table. Um, and you do get these rugs from the senior event. Oh, with all of that, like, tacky stuff. You do get the, um, and also you do get those red chairs. So inventory in this one isn't too bad. Um, you also get those, uh, hanging lamps. Layout is okay. Not my favorite. And here is this house. Um, on the outside, it doesn't really look like much. It's... It's something that I'm just like, eh, it's too white. But you have an empty basement. And then when we come in here, we have the desert oasis doors. And some of the French event items. And you do get that king size bed there. It's really not much uh, when you're looking at it inventory-wise, at least on the downstairs. You get 
the chalet table. And those ugly countertops. Why do we even have those in the game? Those are ugly. And then when you come upstairs. Again, not really much in terms of inventory. This house is very white. Which I'm guessing that's what they wanted. A white house. Um, personally, I think it's a little kind of drab. But... That's just me. Um, when you go upstairs, you do have the exercise bikes. And, yeah, that's about it. I mean, layout of this house, it's not my favorite at all. Um, Inventory-wise, I would just save your money, honestly. It's, I mean, like, it's okay, but, yeah. Here is this house. And you do get the downtown event um, at the windows. And you do get the chalet windows. And also the chalet doorways on the outside. It comes with the pool. And you do, and you do get the chalet items in this house. And also that rustic fireplace. You do get that TV there not too bad and you come up the stairs you do get that fountain and when you come in, in the bedrooms there's really not much in terms of inventory uh but the layout is isn't bad um again it's not my favorite but it's cute and here is this home. And on the outside, this home is actually very cute. You are getting uh, the chalet windows with this. And also that railing. And the light brown garage door. Um, there's a bathroom over here. You do get that sink and that towel holder. And, and also the kitchen. You get those counter tops and you do get that black stove and the hanging pots you get this gray couch you know along with the bookshelves so not too bad in terms of inventory if you're a brand new player and these white doors in the house I think were part of an online pack if I remember correctly so I mean so inventory wise um, and layout wise, it's not bad. Here is this house. This sucker is huge. And you get the French event windows in this one and the homestead doors. And you do get that car out front. Um, these rooms are really big. I'm not a big fan of this house. I just think it's way too big. The rooms are way too big. It's just not... I don't know. It's not my favorite. And I'm just... I don't know. I'm not a fan of it at all. Um, but inventory-wise, you do get the urban items. And you do get those pool items out there. Um, I don't think they're anything new. And you, um, and you do get the outdoor stools and the bar. And a couple of the garage items. You get the the French event items and also the villa items. So, yeah, it's just, I don't like this house. Here is this house. On the outside, it looks quite nice. And you do get um, the French event windows and doorways. Um, in this one. And in the basement here, you're getting um, a gaming table, that stereo, the exercise bikes, and the spa items. And when you go up the stairs, you get the foosball table, um, some urban items. Some more of the front event items. And 
you do get that swing set in the back and also that flower patch the coin patch i think it is you if i remember correctly and then this house has an elevator but in terms of inventory so far mm -hmm, it's it's okay you uh you do get the toddler playhouse there um but you're not really getting much there have been architect homes that have more in it but this one doesn't seem to have much so i would save your money on this one even if you're a brand new player and just see what the other homes have in store this one in terms of layout it's again it's not my favorite but that's just me but the outside looks cute here is this house this house is a repeat we had this house in the last round i believe so you're getting the same inventory and yeah it's the same inventory same layout everything you know everything is just the same so you know just um just have in mind what you already have in your inventory uh personally i think the house is cute but that's about it i don't think it it really has anything much in terms of inventory except for you know except for the windows right there you want the curtains you might like those here is this house this house is just creepy looking i don't know what it is it's just it just looks scary um so yeah i'm just um but you do get that nice car out front and when you go inside you do get that rug and you do get those uh, those bookshelves, the gray couch, and the green chairs, and then also the chalet fireplace, which is quite nice. And and you do get uh, the villa doors, the French event items, and also that wedding light. They always put that in architect homes. It never fails. It's always in every you know in every round you um you get that light i don't know why that is but that's just how it is inventory wise the house is okay i think that i think that you may get more from the houseboats and the apartments but this house it's not my favorite here is this house right here now this one looks very cute you know and well put together um i do like how they have the bay windows and and also those doors are from the london event and you do get these windows that were also from the london event the avalon terrace i think it is i don't know and so and so it's a duplex so when you go inside of the duplex um you have uh, those countertops and also that sink and and then over here on this side you do get those art deco uh, counter tops and sink as well here is um a close-up you know these uh, countertops and yeah i mean it's not bad um um if you wanted those uh those black art deco the countertops i think they were part of an online pack i think um and then when you go up the stairs and there's there's some art deco items up here um and also the family furnishings event there's there's that wardrobe there with the blue doors and also this couch it's a lavish couch i think and also the coffee table 
Um, and also the stairways are from the uh, London event as well. You do get the Latin, the Latin fireplace. So overall, this home is actually really cute. I think that they had done a great job with this one. And, and also the inventory is not bad. If you're a brand new player, you may want to get this house. It's really cute. And here is this house. Um, again, I believe this is a repeat. We, uh, we had it quite a while ago. And you do get that car out front. And then, of course, um, you have this basement. You have the hair event items in here. And also those bookshelves. So, not too bad. You have the... You have... You have some inventory in here that may be good to get. Uh, you have this wallpaper. You do have those red stools in there. And some chalet items. Urban items. I think those red chairs are from the urban event, I think. And also these palm trees here. And you do get a pool outside. Um, that rug, you do get that rug as well as some lavish items. So not too bad, you guys, not too bad. You're getting the chalet fireplace. That's not too bad either. And... You're getting some infant items and it's, yeah, you're getting quite a bit. The layout of this house is not my favorite. I'm not really a fan, but you do get uh, that pirate bed and also this pirate doll house so overall this house isn't bad i'm not a fan of the layout but but the inventory in this house is not bad at all you do get these black stools so so you do get quite a bit in terms of inventory for this house so if you're a brand new player just you know just have your eye on this house and see if there's anything in here that you may not have there uh there is quite a bit of those black stools so um so that was the architect homes and overall i don't think they're worth it with maybe a couple of them um having some nice inventory but other than that i would um look at the houseboats and the penthouse apartments and see what they have instead